back to my channel. I really hope you guys are having an amazing day. Thank you so much for joining me. In today's video, I will be showing you this makeup tutorial right here using the Nerve and Decay Naked Heat Palette. I know that you guys have seen so many tutorials with this, but I wanted to give it a shot and show you this makeup look. So if you want to know how I got this, then just keep on watching. I, first of all, like the packaging is so cute. Like seriously, oh my goodness, it's so pretty. Um, and I love that it comes with a brush. I haven't used a Naked Palette in the longest time. So I already have my eye. This eye is like watering so much and I have no idea why. Um, I had my allergies like upping up for the past few days and this eye is like <laughs> doesn't want to leave me alone. Like it's watering so much. So hopefully like my eye doesn't like ruin my eye look today. So. So I want to look presentable today. I'm going to go ahead and get started. And I'm going to be taking the third color right here. This is the color um, Sauced. I'm going to take that and that's going to be going on my crease. And that's going to be our transition color. have no idea what look I want to go for with this palette. Um, obviously, it's going to be very warm toned. Because <laughs> the whole palette is like warm I'm going to be taking low blow which is the fourth one and I'm going to be placing that on top of sauce take my Sigma E40 and I'm just gonna blend the edges and I kind of want to go a little bit dark um, for this eye look so I'm gonna be taking the color um, heat double which is um, the six six color right here so it's this one right here and I'm gonna be taking that on a Morphe M433 and we're going to kind of do a halo eye. So I'm going to apply this on my outer corner. And the word, like, we're going to be blending that after. So I'm just going to place that. And then I'm going to take it on my inner corner. I'm going to be grabbing a Morphe... M518 and I'm just gonna blend that with no like product. My eye keeps watering. <laughs> I'm gonna be sticking with that Morphe M433 and I'm gonna go ahead and take the color and Fuego, which is this one right here third to last and I'm going to be taking that again on my outer corner and then bringing it on my inner corner and then connecting it connecting both on the crease I use for transition the uh, Morphe M533 and blending my crease and then because I want to go a little bit deeper than that I'm going to be taking this Morphe R41 and I'm going to take the color ashes which is the second to last this one right here and I'm going to take that and just put it really tiny amount on that outer corner Just a tiny, tiny bit. And then building it up. And then I'm going to go back in with that Morphe M433 and blending the crease. Taking 
taking this Morphe M518 and without any excess um, product, I'm just going to be blending my crease. So for my center of my lid, I'm going to go ahead and take the fourth, fifth shadow and it's called Lumbre and it's this one right here. And I'm going to be taking just my finger just because I know that with shimmery shadows, they are best applied with the finger. So I'm just going to take my ring finger and I'm just going to pat that on my lid. And I don't particularly go for like really like these types of looks. Like it's out there because it's dark and I don't usually do like dark looks. But obviously like I needed to do. I wanted to use as much eyeshadows as I could from this palette. <laughs> And then I'm going to be taking that Morphe M433 and I'm going to take a little bit of that En Fuego, so the third eyeshadow, and I'm going to place a little bit just here to blend my corners from that lid shade. And I want to add a little bit more intensity for like my outer corner and my inner corner, so I'm going to take again that Ashes um, eyeshadow, the second to last. And I'm going to apply that on my outer corner and on my inner corner. And going back to that Morphe M433 and blending it. For my eyebrow highlight, I'm going to be taking the color um, Ounce and it's the first in the palette. And that's going to be our brow bone highlight. pencil brush and I'm going to apply that same color to my inner corner and because I really like it really bright under um, I mean inner corner I'm going to be taking from the Kathleen uh, Morphe times Kathleen lights uh, palette and I'm going to be taking that shimmery color right here and I'm going to apply that of my inner corner highlight Okay, for my lower lash line, I'm going to be taking the Morphe Eighth 18 and I'm just going to apply low blow, so the fourth eyeshadow right here. And I'm going to apply that to my lower lash line and then I need a close up mirror. And I'm going to take that short shader brush in the color and Fuego and I'm just going to apply it, apply it to my lower lash line. For my waterline, I'm going to be taking the Scandalize Waterproof um, Rimmel Black Eyeliner and I'm just going to apply that to my lower lash line. Ooh, it's been a long time since I've worn black eyeliner. I'm going to go ahead and take the um, color Ashes, so the uh, purple color right here and I'm just gonna apply that on that uh, R41 and I'm gonna blend the black liner with my lower lash line um, and I'm gonna uh, go ahead and tight line Okay, so for mascara, I'm going to be taking the uh, Maybelline Big Colossal Big Shot in uh, Black is Black. And I'm going to go ahead and apply my falsies. Today, I'm going to be using the Coco Lashes in this style, Bella. First, lining up my lips with Urban Decay 24-7 Glide On Lip Pencil in the color Naked. And then from ColourPop, I'm going to be taking the lipstick in the color De Deja? Deja, and it's a matte finish. I really 
really hope you guys enjoyed it and if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you haven't subscribed please subscribe to the little button down there it'll notify you whenever I upload a new video and as always all the makeup products that I use today are going to be linked down in the description box as well as all my social media and until then I'll see you guys in the next video bye